Okay. Get right back up. Get my revenge on this piece of shit. Lock that. Yeah, that's where I'm supposed to fall, right there. More skeptic spice. Nothing there. Nothing there. Okay. Ha. More support. They like their skeptic spice in this area, huh? Tear stone ring? I'm sure it's nothing good. When there is a danger, it increases your defense. Yeah, it's shit. It's shitty. I love hammering these small people. It's great. Fun. You're not even facing me. What are you doing? Bellkeeper's bow. Whoa. Is that a boss? I think so. I think that may be the, uh, the gargoyle boss. But it's locked. I gotta find a way to open the door. Maybe I gotta go up. enemy placement. Fucking put one right there around the corner so you couldn't back around and fight them. <clears throat> God damn it. These goddamn little shits. In real life, you pick it up and toss it right off the fucking tower and be like, fuck you. What are you gonna do? Now they can stop it. You little fucking freak. <laughs> I'm just kidding, by the way. It's not their fault that they're small. It's like I just said earlier today. People who make fun of people for physical problems that they can't help, things that they grew up with or were born with. Like, you're the lowest form of human. Seriously. Why would you make fun of someone for something they can't control that they were born with? It's not their fucking fault. I was born tiny. Well, first of all, I fell right through a hole and almost died. That's your own fault. But, you know what I mean? What the... What the ganking shit? Hurry up. Little people are coming. Hurry up. I got hurt? How? They could do that. That ain't right. Come on. Well, at least I got my souls. All right, I rang the goddamn bell. Fuck. Oh, 
gonna oh shit oh my god little motherfuckers radiant I got a twilight herb and a radiant gem or some shit I'm out of here I'm out of here fuck you ah Human monsters. I'm fuck it. I'm escaping to a boss. Oh my god, he got an extra hit. Oh my god, there's four of them? That shit. Fuck off. Yeah! Yeah! Good shit. They got. What the fuck? What hit me? Oh my god! This little shit came after me. He stood there patiently for the whole gargoyle fight, turned around, and just fucking tried to kill me.
I seriously can't believe he turned around and tried to kill me, dude. Holy crap, dude. I've got a lot of shoutouts to give. Shout out to... Alright, King Jezel says I'm using the word the term ganked wrong. Ganked is when uh, gang kill. Like a gang of people come and gang up and kill you. Okay. Shanked is probably what I'm looking for. Shanked. Uh, Ping Pong Peg did a $100 tip. It says cream cheese and Pepsi. Very good. Ooh, really? Well, enjoy. It doesn't sound good to me. Thank you, Viking, for the 100-bit cheer. This is great, Phil. And Duke XJT just did a 100-bit cheer. Thank you, everybody. Whew, I did it. Well, first try, right? Pretty cool. Beating to pulp, says. Beat them to pulp. All right, beat the gargoyles on the first shot. Dude, these maces were sick. Seriously, these bases were amazing. Now what do I do? I'm assuming there's something here, a reward. A reason I did this. Wait a minute. There's a chest. And a bonfire. Southern Ritual Band. One of the secret treasures restored in Aldia. This modest looking ring contains very powerful magic. To imagine what unspeakable deeds were once performed to create such rings, one need only recall the cruel fate of the residents of Aldia. So I'll just let you do more spells. Darn. I thought there was going to be... I didn't get the key that I need. I need a key to open the doors near the Lost Center, and I didn't get it. Uh. Huh. Just ahead of my ass. Hmm. There's a ladder. I don't know. What was the point of killing those gargoyles? Was that optional? Because I don't think I had to do that, did I? I think that was optional. Oh, Third Eye the Third said it was the Bastille Key, which I have already. Oh, then why'd I fight the gargoyles? I mean, it's cool to fight every boss. What was the point? Huh. Oh. Okay. That Anonymous says in the original Dark Souls 2 you had to kill those gargoyles and over here there would have been a key. But I already got the Bastille key. They give it to you in this version when you beat the Ruin Sentinels, I guess. Ah. Where the fuck does this go? There's a room. Oh my god, there's a lot over here. There's a room down there. Yeah, see, there's a bunch of dogs. There's a bunch of items I haven't gotten yet. All right, well. <clears throat> I guess I'll go level up, right? All right. Oof. Ugh. Alright, so, I have 35,000 goddamn souls. Holy shit. This is gonna be a lot of leveling. Bearer of the curse. Seek, seek, lest... I need more equipment load, don't I? What gives you equipment load? Endurance? No, that gives you poise. Equipment load is vitality. And that gives you poison resistance, defense. It would give me a, about six more pounds of equipment load. Huh. Hmm. What do you guys think? Should I do vitality? Should 
Strength was good. It's certainly upped by damage by a ton, right? Hmm. I think I'm going to do Vitality. I haven't done it in a million years. Plus, look how much. I mean, it's great. It's going to be huge. All right. I'm going to do Vitality. Nice. What's my equipment load now? 49. I got under 50. See, I got heavier when I put out the mace, pulled out the maces, but now I'm under 50 again. So now I'm actually fucking fast again. Yeah, look. Nice. All right, these maces came in really handy, man. All right, um. So. I guess that's it for now. What I'll do. What we will do is I'll return, obviously. Wait a minute. Oh. That's considered Sinner's Rise. Okay. I didn't realize that was considered Sinner's Rise. Okay. Um. And then here we go. Belfry Luna. That's where I just unlocked the upper ramparts of Belfry Luna. So I'll probably go back there next and check that area out. And then maybe I'll go back and fight a lost sinner. And then I'll have to return to these other areas, right? Like, for example, Doors of Pharos I still have to do. And then Grave of Saints I still have to do. So I still have a lot left. All right, cool. Cool.